Another episode of Sneak and Shopping Therapy. Today's another day, it's Sunday. Getting ready to go to Eindhoven, so did get to shoot that video yesterday, man. So I'm gonna shoot through these two pairs of shoes uh, that I've managed to pick up and collect. Uh, box one, I guess. And let's open that up, man. This box, because I seriously, seriously can't remember what the shoe is. Seriously can't. Uh, but it's a Jordan box, uh, size. 11.5 okay okay it is an Air Jordan 14 so it is the 14 uh, as you can see there definitely a dope shoe I can't remember the shoe at all even though it's a 14 ah okay 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 the yellow Ferraris okay so it's a surprise to me what they look like I've not tried to see these in hand uh, or look at any other reviews because I wanted it to be a surprise, man. I wanted this to be a surprise for me. I wanted this to be a surprise for you. So that's the 14 there. Can we get that to focus, baby? Um, so pretty dope shoe. That seems like plastic. Well, that seems like rubber, rubber, rubber. So it's not real carbon fiber up there. Um, that just seems like plastic to me. Um, pretty much rubbery the leather to be honest feels quite rubbery as well and we got the Jordan up top you know is it a nice shoe um, yeah, I don't know I don't know tell me what you think man tell me what you think of these particular Jordans man the 14 is the Ferrari yellow Ferraris this isn't the suede there's no suede on this this would have been dope if it was the new buck suede up here I think I think that yeah it's an okay shoe I'm gonna say it's an okay Jordan it's not you know it's not lighting me up I'm gonna be honest come back in about it's got the 23 on the back come back in about I don't know three years I may change my mind on it I think this one's gonna be a grower. Um, I think this one's gonna be a grower, to be honest. I don't think straight off the bat it's gonna be a dope shoe. One I'm gonna go, oh yeah, this. But I think this one in about three, four years, people will say, oh, I should have grabbed those. Um, because I think then, then they realize what this shoe is about a bit more. The, the leather is just kinda, yeah, leather. It's pretty hard, pretty tough, pretty hard wearing. So it's a hard wearing leather shoe that you can actually probably go and ball in rather. So if you're balling and you would like a full into balling, then hey, you know what I mean? This is great for you. Cause this looks like a very hard wearing, tough leather to go and ball in. It's got um, Jordan in, the, in there. You can see that, hopefully you can, I don't know. Get that out of the way. So nothing spectacular really. And um, pretty much um, uh, an ordinary 14. So if you like 14s, grab it. If you don't, you don't. But am I mad excited over this shoe? In all honesty, I just am not jumping off the shelf on this one, to be honest. Okay shoe, yeah, I'll hold on to it because I don't have any 14s and I'll just have it in the collection, but not a shoe that's top of my list. Sorry, Jordan brand, I guess. Um, sorry. Uh, will it look dope in future? Hopefully it'll grow on me and then we'll see. I'm not expecting any great things from that particular shoe, uh, to be honest. Yeah, so box two, man. Let's go and have a look at this. I think I know what this is. Oh yeah, and big up, um, is it sneakers and stuff? That's where I got the 14s from. Uh, so if you want to pick some up, pick them up from there. I'm sure they've got plenty of sizes or, yeah, mate, I think this shoe, the 14 is sitting, so you should be able to go off and grab that particular shoe if you want it, right? Um, yeah, it's okay. Uh, so next box, man, box two. This is straight from Nike. Um, I'm just gonna hide that so you can have a look at that. So straight from Nike. Uh, but this one is dope. I, 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 I saw this and I'm really hoping that this isn't as disappointing as the 14. Um, so let's have a look, man. Green Nike box, bro. 
I think we're going to have a bit more detail on this. So if you watch Stranger Things, you should know what this is. Hawkins High. Um, definitely my size. And definitely all the way around. Definitely a dope box. A nice green box, man. I like that bit of difference. We have inside, we have the paper. As you can see there, which is pretty dope. And now I'll start getting messages on my phone because uh, that's what I'm recording on. I'll take a look at that earlier. I think there's going to be stuff in here that you can possibly read uh, that gives some detail about the show. Um, so 4th of July parade, maybe something kicks off there and it just unfolds like so, which is pretty dope. But yeah, uh, Tailwinds, right? I know what you're thinking. No one is messing with these when these redropped and came back out. But to me, this really felt authentic 80s. Uh, hence why I picked up this particular shoe, man. It felt like an authentic 80s shoe, man. Definitely feels more authentic and in line with the silhouette to me. You know what I mean? Definitely more in line. Just the colorway used. Um, everything about this shoe just seems a bit more authentic. It's not trying to be too loud. It's not trying to bring it into up to date. That's not what we were looking for with the tailwinds. We were basically looking for that 80s flex uh, to rock with a pair of Levi's, right? Get your Levi's out, rock on with these. You know what I mean? Get a pair of 501s, man. Get a pair of Levi 501s and rock with this shoe, man. Definitely a pair of Levi 501s and rock with these shoes. Or a pair of Lee if you're into Lee or what have you, man. But definitely, yeah, I love this shoe, man. I think this is, to me, a really dope idea. Dope colorway and dope collab. Um, exactly the same on the back of this shoe, but definitely dope. Should we thumbnail that? Yeah, I think we'll use that as a thumbnail. Maybe we'll do that. Cool. And then use that as a thumbnail. Check that out, bro. Definitely a nice shoe, man. I really like it. I like the materials. I like the mesh. I like the little bit of new buck down here as well that's used on the shoe. Nice leather. Um, feels really nice, really, really quality, like a tumbled Nike swoosh, um, which is absolutely fantastic. We get really close up so you can see the tumbling on there. Absolutely dope, absolutely on point, and just have it all the way look. And to be honest, I think sort of like tumbling at the back, look at that, check that out, man. Really good quality. They've definitely done a good job on this shoe. Definitely a good job on this shoe. This is definitely the Stranger Things. Uh, there are another couple of colorways that dropped. Uh, some blazers as well. I didn't manage to grab those, but grab these. And I'm